Tony McElton facing the X Division Championship. That is what your new X Division Champion is all about. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is set for one fall. Introducing first, he represents Moose Nation. He is Moose. Well, we, know, we know what Moose is all about. We saw his opponent from Overdrive, Bully Ray, earlier on this evening. Bully Ray won that Overdrive in a tables match. And when it comes to Moose and Bully Ray, what's the scumbag? Oh, likes the scumbag. And this particular scumbag like losing, especially on a large stage like Overdrive. So you have to imagine that Moose is in a foul mood here tonight looking to rebuild some momentum coming out of that loss at Overdrive. opponent from Punjab, India, Bupinder Kuzer! competed in a six-way X Division showcase on the countdown to Overdrive. Well, if anyone's excited for Christmas, then Access TV is the place to be. Jingle all the way with the hit show, The Top Ten Revealed. This Tuesday, The Top Ten Revealed experts count down the top Christmas rumors at 8 Eastern here on Access TV. Bruder, I mean, hey, that sounds right up my alley. I should have been on that show. But right now, the star of this show, Lupinder Gujar, who is, and we always say it, gets better and better every time he steps in the ring. But I feel, I still feel like he's looking for that one big win. And man, this could be that if he gets it here tonight. This absolutely would be it. A first time ever matchup. Moose, of course, a former Impact World Champion, the self-proclaimed wrestling god. The better part of six months between 2021 and 2022. Reigned as the Impact World Champion and, in his words, carried this company. And right now, like I said earlier, got a big chip on his shoulder coming out of overdrive. But if you're Bukinder Kujer, man, a victory over a former Impact World Champion. That could be the big it victory, if you will, that Kujer needs. Now, Kujer picking up the momentum here against Moose. Big night of action here on Impact Wrestling. Still to come, Macklin versus Kazarian in a first time ever matchup. Also, the last rodeo, Mickey James versus Deanna Perrazzo. James' career in professional wrestling is on the line. And also, what is going on with Eric Young and Diener? Young telling Diener to meet him where it all began tonight. We're gonna keep an eye on that here on Access TV. As right now, Moose is cutting off Gujar at the pass. Big boot to the face. And now, well, he, he's looking to put this one away now. Out here on the floor, oh this God. could be it. Oh, the power bomb oh. into the apron oh. by Moose. That is absolutely devastating. Five. Any momentum that Gujar had Six. has quickly, quickly gone out Seven. the window. Bupinder Gujar's in trouble. Can he get back in it against Moose? This match continues here on Access TV as Gujar beats the count. The match rolls on. And we are back here on Access TV. Moose still in firm command against Bupinder Gujar in this first time ever matchup. And Ray Walt, it's been Moose just taking his time here against Gujar. Yeah, Mo Moose has a point to prove. He's got a, again, I want to say it, a chip on his shoulder. He's got some frustrations to work out after everything that happened at Overdrive, losing that. You see the tape on the back of Moose, losing that tables match to Bully Ray, who proved himself to truly be the scumbag we knew him to be earlier tonight. And Bully Ray getting disqualified in a matchup against Rick Swan, and then it was a, a pure chaos here in the Impact Zone. Tommy Dreamer and the executive vice president of Impact Wrestling, Scott Demore, came out here to try and stop Bully Ray. Bully Ray, ultimately, he's going to get what he wants come hard to kill Friday the 13th hey, Troy, of January hey, live on pay per view and TV. Bully Ray versus Josh Alexander for the Impact World title. And that is a defiant Bupinder Gujar, who's absolutely had enough here of Moose. Oh, standing Uranagi by Moose. 
A little flurry there, Raywalt, from Gujar, but Moose shuts it down. Hey, but sometimes that's all you need is to continue to show life. But Moose now looking to line up Gujar. Could be looking for that spear to put this one away. This would end Gujar's night. Oh, spear oh, and Gujar able to avoid it. And Moose goes shoulder first into the turnbuckle. Oh, and a kick by Gujar. Great spotting here from Gujar. Good counter. Obviously knows the wrestling god well here. And a rip corn knee attack. This is the momentum Gujar needed earlier on. Can he keep it going? Beautiful sling blade there by Gujar. And now he's got to capitalize. This is where the foot has to stay on the gas, especially with an opponent with the capabilities of Moose. Oh, we saw Moose going for his spear. Is it time for Gujar's gargoyle spear? Set up in the corner. Is he's this hurt. it for Moose? Oh, and Moose did his homework. Not what Gujar wanted. Oh, Moose went for his spear again. Oh, and there it is. Big time spear from Moose. Moose beats Gujar. Here is your winner, Moose. Uh, come on now, Moose pummeling Gujar after the match, trying to make a statement after his disappointment from Overdrive. Yeah, those frustrations still boiling over. And now just getting rid of Gujar, no respect whatsoever. But no surprise coming from the self-proclaimed wrestling god. Do you know who I am? I'm the guy who told you exactly who Bully Ray is. And all you Kentucky fried idiots that didn't listen to me. I told you that Bully Ray was gonna screw Josh Alexander just like I did at Bound for Glory. But you idiots, once again, didn't listen to me. Do you really think I lost that overdrive? Hell no. I won that overdrive because I was right. Now, I never want to hear Bully Ray's name ever again. In fact, I don't want none of you idiots to say his name.
What the hell are you doing in my ring? What the heck am I doing? You called me up. I was talking about bully and I was handling serious business. So I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Well, Moose, allow me to explain. You said, say his name, and he appears. And usually when someone does that, that's their way of saying, we believe. I know all these idiots want to have a good time, but I don't have time for your fun and games. So I'll advise you to get the hell out of my ring before I seriously hurt you. Back to what I was oh, saying. Oh, oh, Moose, Moose, just, just one thing. If you really want Joe Hendry to just get on out this ring, we can do that, but... I don't think that's really what you want. You see from a current champion to a former one. I know a cry for help when I see one.